ask you how to fix couldn't pair with because of an incorrect pin or pass key problem in android hey guys welcome back to one million idc2 channel in this video i'm going to show you that how you can fix couldn't pair with bluetooth problem in your device but before proceeding further make sure to subscribe my youtube channel and hit the bell bell icon to receive all the latest update now let's begin the tutorial okay guys in whatever bluetooth you are trying to connect with uh, it doesn't matter whether you are trying to connect with a smartwatch or headphones or your uh, offers or your on your TV or in any devices. It doesn't matter. I'm going to tell you the exact solution which will definitely help you to fix your problem. I'm going to tell you nearly about 8 to 10 solution which will definitely help you to fix your problem. So I request you to stick with the video till the end. Okay. Now let's begin the solution. Number one solution is that restart your device okay now see guys restarting device like say restart both the device you are trying to pair okay and the device you are trying to connect to this can often clear up any temporary glitches software glitches in your device okay so restart both of the device you are trying to connect with each other okay and then just try to reconnect your bluetooth with each other devices okay so if this solution fixes your problem that's great but guys if this does not fix your problem then i advise you to follow the next solution which is turn off your bluetooth once okay turn off your bluetooth once just i did now on the screen as you can see sometimes simply uh toggling the bluetooth feature off and then turn on can resolve connectivity issue okay so just turn off and then turn it on and try to connect to try to pair with the other device and then you will see that your problem is fixed but guys if you still have the problem then follow the four a third solution which is check device settings ensure that bluetooth is enabled on both devices and that they are said to be discoverable or visible to each other sometimes in our bluetooth settings we don't put it uh, as a discoverable mode and that is the reason like uh, go to the advanced settings and then from here you can do those settings okay bluetooth control history or pairing request or other bluetooth scan history you can just scan and then check uh, make sure that it is in the discoverable mode okay now the fourth solution is that you need to check for interference okay bluetooth signals can be affected by interference in your device okay so on both devices and they are set to okay like move the device closer with each other okay so if you want to if you want to solve the issue of the signal that is interfering on your device then move the device close together and uh, away from the electronic devices or object that could cause interference okay so this is the solution uh, you can do now the fifth solution is that you need to uh, open your open your turn your bluetooth and then come here and then if you are trying to like if you have a lot of devices added recently in your device you you have been connecting with so many devices uh, in your bluetooth settings then you just need to come and then uh, remove some of them okay just like this uh, i'll remove this car unpair it and then unpair it and then this one also unpair it and then again what you need to do is scan and then check okay if you find any bluetooth option then reconnect it just unpair and then repair and then check that will help you uh, that will help you fix your problem and then it will connect you okay so if you have previously uh, previously paired the device but are experiencing issue try this uh, unpair and then repair okay this will help you fix the problem now the seventh solution is that uh, go to your mobile device settings and then you have to reset your bluetooth settings okay for this you have to go to uh, general management in the samsung device but uh, if you do not uh, like if you're not getting the general management option then you can simply go to your mobile device settings in any of the android phone go uh, settings go to settings and then click on the search bar and then type reset -E reset okay so when you click reset you'll get the option here go to reset again and then you have the option here reset a wi-fi and bluetooth settings as you can see here okay so these settings usually find in samsung device in general 
management go to general management if you are using samsung phone and then from here you have to go to reset and then from here as you can see reset wi-fi and bluetooth settings so you just need to click on the reset settings and reset your bluetooth settings and then go and try to repair your bluetooth and then you will see that your problem is fixed okay now the eighth solution is that check battery levels low battery levels can sometimes cause connectivity problems ensure that both devices have sufficient battery charge okay now the 10th or number nine solution is that try a different device if you are not able to connect with a particular device then try a pairing or one of the device which uh, with a different bluetooth device to determine if the issue is with the device or with the bluetooth connection itself okay so if you are able to connect with the other devices then uh, the problem might be with the device that you are trying to connect okay so you have to do that and the last solution is that guys you uh, not the last second last solution is go to settings and go to bottom and then check for your software update sometimes not updating our software could lead us to many different glitches make sure that both devices have the latest software updates installed manufacturers often release updates to improve compatibility and fix bugs even the bluetooth issues okay so make sure that both of the uh, devices have the latest software and then the last solution is that uh, contact support if none of the none of the mentioned uh, solution resolve the issue contact the manufacturers uh, customer support for further assistance okay just contact your mobile company mobile device company and then uh, go to their contact support and then they may have specific troubleshooting step or be able to provide a solution so by following this step you should be able to troubleshoot and potentially fix the current pair with bluetooth issue i hope this video definitely helped you thank you so much for watching till then bye bye take care